Hello YouTube So, as many of you have requested Here's the quick guide on how to patch your UMA JP into English Right, so let's jump right into it uh, But before that, I have a disclaimer Two of them so Number one Applying this patch is considered against the TOS of Uma Musume JP. So please be aware of the risk of getting banned when doing so. So this will be a very important disclaimer before we begin. Okay, so please proceed at your own risk. Now, number two, uh, please make a backup of your account which means you must have a data link in your uh, JP Uma account right so what you need is simple you will need the trainer ID and the linking password for that ID so how do you get that right so this is a quick uh, show demonstration rather of the Uma uh, English patch let's go into the menu and you click here data link so you just see the icon here click on that click the green button and then it will ask you these two things here if you're a first timer that means you start the account without like purchasing it or getting it from a friend or something you will have to click the bottom one which means you will have to set your first password right so you click the green button and then just make your password and everything click the agreement there and then you will proceed uh, hopefully you're clear where you want to get the trainer ID in your password it's here but in case you are unsure uh, like you're not confident in like ability to make sure you press the right buttons don't worry uh, my suggestion is simple so you go to your emulator again basically just uh, create a new one and then start fresh like you're from empty right so this is my new instance that i made basically empty no uma install as you can see here right and only the open vpn here which is crucial to play the game right so let's jump into it so what do you need to do you need to download a few things here in which you might see here which is this thing right here let's go to the browser So first of all, you want to visit this website called Kupi. All right, this is basically Ku app, but you directly download it. Much easier, right? So what you want to do is key in this number six one seven two. This is the I believe the number for the Uma Musume APK. Just click on that arrow here or enter, and then just verify yourself. Of course, I am not a bot. Right, so what you have to do is simple. You need to click download on the two APKs here. So you click split APK, click the gray box here, and then it will ask you to download. I already downloaded it, so no need. Right. Now, once you download it, click done, no worries. And then base APK, the same thing. It will download for you, right? But for me, it's already done. So I'll click cancel here. Right, so once you are done on that, you need to go to the link in the description below. Right, so we have three links here. So number one here, you need to download the patch itself. The patch itself is this one. The first one here. So copy this, go to your browser, click paste it, and click on it. Okay, so now it'll ask you to download something called APK release and an APK. Okay, I already downloaded it, so click cancel me right so what you're downloading is essentially this one okay so once you're done downloading and install it okay you will be presented with a screen so what you want to do click normal install and then you'll see here tap to select files okay let's do that right now okay so remember those uh, two things that you download just now okay so what you want to do is click and hold right and then you click this one also then you click open now you see two files selected click patch 
uh, let it do its thing we're hacking the mainframe all right so you're done just click install all right no problem and then it says done okay complete now don't start game yet because for emulator you have to do one extra step so go back home now you need to go to files okay go here you'll see this thing here right and then you have to do pop right here show internal storage and then here and then click your internal storage and you go to Android go to media and then you need to create a new folder now what do you have to do to rename the folder this one right here okay just copy and paste this exactly and then all right now click open on that also create a new folder and you name it this thing right now you're done but once you open this it's empty right you have to download another thing here okay and that's where the third link here comes into play you copy this copy this link go back to the browser and then you paste it of course just click on it it will auto show you to this uh, page right here but what you have to do you need to save this as a config uh, file very simple just click Control S, and you'll see this. It's already downloaded. Perfect. Now go back to files just now. So remember the path here, okay? So why I want to start from here is simple. So you can remember where you come from. So just press back, okay? Remember that. Uh huh. From here to here into here. Now from here, you go to download, and you'll see config, right? simple press and hold top right move to or copy to let's just copy to make it safer you click on the top right here go to this one android yeah this one this one and you click copy here and it should be done but of course you need to make sure same step Check it and you'll see it is in there okay great this is very important if you don't do this step the game will not start right so now with that out of the way go back to the menu and uh, let's enjoy your first start of the game let's get it a full screen it no problem ah and then you will see this this is important so you need to set up this first for sure let me close the volume a bit click next and you will be presented with this what do you need to do here okay this is uh, your translation language basically so as you can see we have three for english uh, i think i believe the best one is the top one right so i will choose that this is for if you are a mandarin speaker you probably want to use this and then uh, this one is for Indonesian so to my neighbor country if you want to use this kalian boleh guna yang ini ya alright uh, so let's choose this one uh, the first one right now and then just click down here and you should be good and then it will ask you to download the update for the translation and you just click yes uh, as simple as that right all right and you're good to go now just press start no need to restart the game all right so we're done what do you have to do of course make sure to connect to your vpn before you play the game i forgot to show you that because uh it's already connected for me and with that said that's it for this video today thanks for watching guys please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and uh, 
I also would like to promote my Twitch. I do live stream of Uma. I play Chaos Zero Nightmare, HSR, Epic Seven, and many more. Even Nikki, right? So if you guys are interested in watching me to do live streams, or if you want to ask me live when I'm streaming, just come to the stream. Like, just ask any question. Like, just just mention the game that you're playing, and I'll try to help you. All right? Yeah, that'd be it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye, everyone.